How do you do, my friends, everywhere and abundant in number? Men and women, boys and girls, children, people. I am Professor Julius Sumner Miller, and my business is physics, and our special business today, the wonderful behavior of a bob on a string. A bob on a string. And someone must certainly be led to say, Professor, how can you be enchanted by a thing so trivial? What is that all about? And my answer, I could lecture for 100 hours and not exhaust the subject. But for us here, an exercise which you can do yourself and be enchanted by it. First, we observe that I have a bob on a short string whose motion is fast. Then I have a bob on a longer string whose motion is slower. And then I have a bob on a longer string still whose motion is slower still. And I'm going to propose an exercise which reveals some wonderful numbers. And so I would talk to you about the beauty of numbers. Oh, there's so much to say. Like prime numbers, for example. Prime numbers. You know one is prime, three is prime, five is prime, seven is prime, eleven is prime, thirteen is prime. I call attention to that pair. This is called a closely packed prime pair. Eleven and thirteen. Seventeen and nineteen is a closely packed prime pair. An interesting exercise for you to contemplate and mock you. I may never get back to this experiment. Why? Because I am so delighted with prime numbers that I might talk to you for a whole hour about prime numbers. Here's the exercise for you. 11, 13, 17, 19, uh, 29, 31. Yeah, they are prime. As we go higher in the number system, the occurrence of closely packed prime numbers gets less often. Question, do they run out? That's a good question. It has been a question for us for 2,000 years since Euclid, and we have not the answer yet. Another thing, I left out the number two. Notice all the prime numbers are odd numbers. Are there any even primes? Yes. Two is the only one. You know what a prime number is. It has factors only itself and one. So, I'll have to tell you on another program more about prime numbers because I cannot really, uh, in conscience clear, uh, escape the talk about them. But here, short string and bob, longer. And here's what I want to have. I want to have three of these in the manner I show you. And I want them to be a very special length. I want this one to be 10 centimeters long. Want this one to be 40 centimeters long. And I want that one to be 90. 10, 40, and 90 centimeters long. Then what am I going to do? With a clock, a stop clock, I am going to set one into motion and clock it. Let me clock, say, 20 vibrations. See, I start zero, one, two, three, and so weiter, and so further. I clock 20 vibrations, the time for 20 oscillations. I clock 20 oscillations of this one. This one is 40 centimeters, and I clock 20 oscillations of that. This one is 90 centimeters long, and I clock 20 oscillations of that, and I write down the time. See, it'll be zero, one, two, three, and so on. I clock 20. Zero, one, two, three, four, and so on. I clock 20, and I write the numbers down. I'll write them right in there on the next program, and you will see how enchanting those numbers are. And I thank you for watching us.